Yeah, bro, the update's out. This is it, Gorilla Glue. This is the update. I'm not a big fan of it, but it's here, bro. <laughs> yeah, obviously, yeah, yeah, no days off, man. Um, I gotta do what I gotta do to to uh, fight the fight style, fight the, fight the fight. Um, they changed the damage system, bro. What donut, what donut you want? I, I don't care for a donut right now. Okay. All right, lay you bet me. Me too. Go, go. No, 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 no. Okay, bye. Um, the damage system is new, and we got new fighters as well. So they no longer have the the left, right, center, uh, the head and the body. Now you just got total head damage and total body damage. Yeah, that's that's exactly why you couldn't hurt. You felt like you couldn't hurt anybody. That's exactly why I feel like I don't like the patch. Um. The more I, the more I think I think on it. I feel like they sh Yeah, I feel like they shouldn't they shouldn't have taken away same side damage or nerfed it because now it just looks like some punches um like just don't even work whatsoever. I feel like um Cause it, it seems weird when when certain when they award you on combos like certain some punches work and some don't. It's just the awkward feeling. Um, I think maybe they need to to balance a little bit more. Um, I think like maybe they took too much. Maybe they took too much damage off the top of a of a back to back punch. They they took too much damage off. That's my thinking. They they um they nerfed some of it too hard and See something like that. Some of the punches I just threw right there, I feel like those punches should have been awarded a rock. Um and just like the the overall like I think it's like the overall combo is is what I have a problem with. Like now there's now there's an overall it's not per se harder to rock somebody but you definitely need you need a longer you need a longer combo which i find really weird you need a you need a longer more more variety combo which is just strange to me. It's absolutely strange. Cause it, it feels like it feels like, um, it just feels like punches don't matter. I mean, that's, that's the, that's the one thing that I could just like, it, it feels like they just don't matter.
I'm like that's the problem that I've always had with the game. That's why like in the in the beginning when I was playing 1x damage and I went to 1.5, I felt like okay, when you go to 1.5, you can ramp up the damage and the punches hurt. Like you could rock somebody with one punch. I don't even feel like you can rock somebody with one punch anymore. That's the problem. It's like it's very it's very uh I don't know like Yeah, I feel I feel like that's still in the game. Like no matter the run thing is still in the game, like no matter what they're going to be able to run from you. I don't think I don't think they they haven't fixed the ability for somebody to run. The run is still in the game. I just don't think the damage is where it needs to be. Like, it still, it just feels odd that you're able to beat the hell out of somebody and they really just like walking through all of your punches. That's the problem that I have. I think it's still it's still hard to rock someone whenever they run. Power definitely um, is here. Seems like there's a lot of blood all over the ring now, which is kind of strange. Is he cut? I seen like I see blood all over the ring. Yeah, po power is definitely a thing. You want to throw, you want to throw more power now. Uppercuts a thing. Uppercuts very valuable now. I'll fight you, Greg. Um, like right there what was that there was two criticals a couple other shots to the head he's clearly hurt can't take him down Left and right critical. His mouth's wide open. He is not going down. That's kind of the stuff that I have a problem with. Pretty much that's it right there. Like that what you just saw, that was it in the that's it in a nutshell. Like powered him in the face. Like I'm really just not understanding. And and then he rocks me. What the fuck just happened right there? This is why I'm not understanding. He rocks me off of one shot. I criticaled him multiple times. Critical again. I now I just feel like fighters just walk through anything. Like they just walk through the the most crazy the craziest shit is that's not a real feeling to me. The game doesn't when I see that, I don't feel like the game feels real.
Yeah, this... Even though I got, I ended up getting the rock right there, like, it's crazy to me. I don't even feel like he's, he had to have been ghost punching the shit out of me. Like, how am I down 35, what is that? Yeah, 35% health. I don't even feel like this guy's been hitting me at all for me to be down 35% health. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, I just think they, they overall, it's it's not the fact that they took away save time damage, it's that, it's that they, they basically just, they, they made some punches just like, like when you punch certain times, they just made it completely, they made the fighter just like completely invulnerable, just like able to walk through anything. Which is odd. That is the weirdest shit. Yeah, you you definitely have to slow down your punch speed. I see that's working for me right now. You gotta slow down your 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 shots. Yeah, be a little be a little bit more patient, like slow down. I think you got to throw like you said just slow down your slow down the amount of punches you throw at one time, like your volume. Um but it's still a very a very weird feeling to me. If the game feels weird, Even though I'm able to knock out this Robinson right here, it feels weird, bro. I wouldn't say that he's this Robinson is fighting very well. He's just he's just throwing himself out. As you see, he's just swinging, 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 swinging until he runs out of stamina. <laughs> what like what is that what is this guy doing to to be able to get awarded a rock the way he's fighting what in the entire fuck he's fighting terrible terrible and they they're awarding him the rock man dreezy am i am i honest opinion fuck no bro fuck no in my honest opinion this, this bitch is a the least thing from valid bro the least that's my opinion a lot of other people come in here and they're super happy they're super happy about it i say fuck no bro fuck no yo thank you for the follow pretty boy I say they they got to put a patch on the patch. This update was great. What's up, pretty boy Oscar? Uh, you said this update was great. I think that's what you're trying to say. I am not a fan of it. 
but I'm I'm working through it. It's my first game back on. Yeah, I'm winning. I wouldn't call this guy a good fighter. I just don't. Hey, man. I'm, all I can say is I'm working through it. There's some stuff that's really weird to me. Like, I see a lot of... It just seems strange. There's a lot of weird stuff. I'm not... I'm just not with the... I'm not with fighters walking through punches. I never have been, even with even in the old patch, the old update, when I saw a fighter walking through a punch, I was never a fan of it. Never. And I see more I see more fighters walking through punches now. And that's what I don't like. I see people walking through punches, and that's a problem. All right, Greg, I'm ready. I'll put it back back on. I'll do 1.5 damage, but not 1.5 stamina cuz you'll be standing around one with one punch in the tank. Okay. All right, all right, great. Yeah, I I see too much um like like I like I said, I think if they had a left same side damage in, like just picture this. If you leave same side damage in, but you also award a combo, I think that could have been a real thing. Like I I think the problem that I have is is like when you throw a right hook, you get, you know, 100% damage. And then you throw that second right hook, it feels more like, I ain't gonna lie, it feels like that second hook hits more like 20% damage. You go from 100 to 20. I think if they put the, if they made the, the second punch, same side, more like 175 it would be a, it would be a little bit more balanced if you went 100 to 75 not like not like 100 like i think in the old way it was like 100 150 like when you hit somebody if you critical somebody and then you hit them again it compounded so it was like 100 150 or maybe like even 100 200 if it was like a double flash like if for whatever reasons you flashed um countered somebody and then they punched and they gave you another flash counter which I, I don't think i've ever seen that but let's just say for the sake of argument if you hit back to back flash counters to the right it would be like 100 200 um i think it would feel better if it was like 100 percent damage and then you hit them again and it was like 75 but you would have but the game should like award more damage if you go right hook uh flash counter left hook so if you go right hook left hook it's like 100 percent damage 100 percent damage and then say you throw right straight 100 percent damage so you got a 300 percent damage right there as opposed to going something like this this is what this is a problem that i'm seeing if you go right hook 100 percent damage right hook again it feels like 20% eh, damage you're at 120 and then let's say you go left jab so now you're at I don't even know now you're at two you're at a 220 so right hook right hook left jab right straight that third right straight I feel like it's not 
you're still getting punished for that same side damage because you went right hook, right hook, left straight, right hook. I don't think you got awarded the the entirety of the damage very well. If you see what I'm saying? That right straight is still on the right side of the head. So I feel like it's going to be 100, 20%, 100%. Eh, I don't know what this is. It's probably going to be like 50%, something like that. I don't know what it is, but that shit don't feel good. I, I don't know what it is, but it doesn't feel good. If you go right, right, left, right, it doesn't feel good. I feel like that's a problem. So, so, what, what's up, Joe? What's up, Joe from the John? So, it feels like what the game really wants you to do, it really wants you to go something like right hook, uh, left jab, right straight, left hook, right uppercut. It wants, it really wants you to do something like that, like really like mix up the range of, the range of punches. And I feel like that's kind of like, it makes sense, but it doesn't make sense to um say, bro, you have to, you on the wrong channel, bro. Today is the wrong day to see somebody go to sleep for me, bro. Like, ooh, we got a patch, and I'm not happy with it. Yeah, so it feel it feels like that uh that like I said, like if if you stay with the right side. It doesn't feel like the game's uh, awarding you anything. Even if you mix up your punches on the right side, which is the you're supposed to get awarded for mixing your punches, I don't I don't feel like it's it's working that way. Um, like say right hook, left jab, right straight, um, left uppercut, um. And you go back to the right hook. I don't think that's a valuable combo because you spent most of your time on the right side. The game really, the game really wants you to 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 like get really broad with it, like right hook, left uppercut, right straight, left hook, um, right uppercut. Like it doesn't want none of the same shit. So let's go ahead and get a fighter. So right now I'm I'm really just fucking with Sugar Ray till I can get till I can really wrap my head around um like what's what's working for me and what's not working for me. I'm just gonna I think I'm gonna stick to one fighter till I really understand the health the health system because I don't to me it's not clicking in my brain. I'm not I'm not understanding that the uh Yeah, Ray Robinson's in the game, yeah. To to me I'm not really understanding the health system at all. It's not real it's not making a lot of sense to me and there's no way to really detect how much damage you're doing anymore because they took the uh the damage bars, they took the bars out the game. So I'm having a hard time understanding if something's even working if it's even working i can only guess and speculate that you know right hook right hook uh left jab right straight is working or not working i don't i don't know i can only speculate what's working oh yeah yeah everybody was playing ray robinson uh i think you'll see a lot of ray robinson still uh, maybe maybe even more now because they they put in more 90 fighters at least one more 90 fighter 
and a fighter that feels like a 90 fighter which is that guy right there uh uh amir khan he feels like a 90 fighter but he's really a 84 83 something like that What's up, man? What did you say your graphics card was? What did I say it was? Yeah, your your your, your graphics, your old graphics card. Um, I can't remember, man. It's in my old PC. I don't remember what it is. You can say it's in the closet outside, right? I think so. I kind of peeped in there. I didn't even see it. I don't. Know. It's supposed to be out there. You probably just have to take out all that shit and put it all back in. And and if you do that, you better do a damn good job, or you know what's gonna happen. What, bro? Is there like another way to improve gaming quality? Um, not really. You need a graphics card. Oh. Okay. Like I said, if you pull all this shit out, you better put it exactly back how you got it or better. I don't think uh, American doesn't doesn't box anymore. He's not he's not a a, a boxer that's boxing right now. He's a, a legend. Is this it? What? No, bro. A whole freaking PC. A whole tower. He's no legend. Oh, well, look at that. I got it wrong. I don't know a whole... I'm not, like, super in-depth about boxing. I'm pretty much the same way, Motai. I haven't really paid attention to boxing. I mean, the last time I think I really paid attention to boxing was probably when Roy Jones and Lennox Lewis were still boxing and shit like that. Like, early 2000s. Yeah. That was, like, the last time I really, I really, like, even knew who some boxers were other than, like, Nowadays, people are talking about Ryan Garcia and Tank Davis a whole lot.
yeah that's pretty much it yeah uh same thing happened to me man once i once i saw like uh k k1 once i saw kickboxing and i saw ufc uh you know uh pride fighter and things like that i was like yo this is way better and i just started watching um more in-depth uh, uh combat I started watching, uh, you know, the combat that was a little bit more brutal. Chuck Liddell and Tito Ortiz, young man, yeah. Yeah, like, there's something about this, I just, the, the way this is going, there's something about this I just don't like, bro. There's something about it I just don't like. That's oh, my wife. Hello? Think counters are key. I don't know what I would consider key. I don't know what I would consider key in this update. Cause like I said, I just see the one thing that I see is people walking through punches. That's what I see. I see people walking through punches and I just I can't ignore it that's one thing that I just I can't ignore I understand valuing combos but I can't ignore 
that somebody can basically go defenseless. Um, this this is what I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna put it like this, man. I noticed something early on. I've been playing all day, and what I noticed is you can basically defend one side of your face. You can defend one side, and and leave the other side defenseless. And listen to why I say this because they award you going from left to right from left to right so if you keep one side invulnerable and you allow the uh, the person to just chew you up on the left side it doesn't fucking matter they can't knock you out right because they've basically made same side invulnerable so you just think about you got an invulnerable side of the face as long as he doesn't tag you up on this side you can do whatever the fuck you want to do that's weird you could lean into one side and just be like hit me hit me hit me hit me hit me and fuck somebody up that's fucking weird Yo, what's up, Eli? I ain't seen you in a minute, bro. You took a little vacation. And then he just caught me. He just caught me with the one piece right in the mouth. Just the one piece. He has a lot of speed. Yeah, man, I don't, I don't know. Like, yeah, I, I, I understand that left body, right body, left foot. Uh, yeah, you just, you know, left, right, top, left, right, bottom. That doesn't seem, that seems ridiculous to me. Left, right, top, left, right, bottom. Left, right, top, left, right, bottom. That, that seems just as ridiculous. That seems just as ridiculous as same side. I have not, Eli. I have not been piecing people up, bro. I I am like, what the fuck, bro? I am highly upset with it. Highly upset. Like, what in the fuck, bro? What in the fuck? I know speed kills. God damn, though, bro. Like, ah, I don't know, bro. I don't know. So I'm at the point where I'm extremely hurt. And he can just one punch rock me for whatever reasons, but one punch rock early in the fight doesn't fucking exist. Like I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused, bro. I'm fucking confused. I'm so fucking confused, bro. And I, and the one thing that what I'm saying right now, like right now, I can't really tell. I see I'm getting knocked out, but I can't really tell if I'm fucking hurt. I need to make it to the to the end of the round so I can see my head health. Like this is this is strange. Like I'm guessing by the way he's knocking me out that my head is on red on both on both sides. I'm guessing. I'm not really sure why I'm getting one punch knocked out. I'm just guessing that my head's on red.
I'm, I'm guessing my head is on red on both sides. So my head health is really bad. But I can't, like, you see what I'm saying? Like, this is fucking crazy. And that's, that's not good either. Like, both people are going to stand around and wait for a counter throw? That's not good. And this dude's faster than me, so he can swing before me and after me. At least something that I used to do works right there. That worked. Something that I used to do. That was original Hook City type shit right there. Original Hook City shit. But I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm gonna be dead honest, man. Like, it does, to me, it does not feel good. To me, it does not feel good. Yo, big angles, big angles. Yo, I'm in here trying to figure it out, big homie. I'm trying to figure it out. You know I'm in a lab. I'm trying to figure out what's going to work for me. some 2.0 damage lobbies and they feel the same as 1.5 yeah bro that and i'm telling you know why why they feel the same is is what i've been what i've been saying to people is they've made certain certain things that you do in the game they've made you invulnerable so i'm gonna i'm gonna tell you this this isn't this isn't a crack the code thing but this is something that i've noticed angles Basically, if you don't allow somebody to hit the opposite side of your face, say you, you're only allowing somebody to hit you on the left side, your left side of the face will basically come become invulnerable. Long as you don't hit them on your right side, they can same, same side spam you all fucking day long. You're good. You got invulnerable over here, and you protect yourself over here. And, and you're straight. And that, that's pretty fucking weird. Because they're going to penalize you for getting hit in the same spot. But as long as you don't let them hit you in the other spot, you Gucci. That makes no sense. Do I box? N nah, I don't box. Mayweather should be OP then. His block is weak. And see right there, I got fucked up because I I was doing some old, some old school shit. I went to the double hook and it didn't pay off. The double hook didn't pay off. Um, uh, <laughs> I don't, bro. That's gonna take me a minute to get that shit out of my system. The double hook didn't pay, so now speed's killing me. Now speed's whooping my ass. So, yo, thank you for the f uh, follow, uh, Conrad. So yeah, man, it's weird like if you I don't know, bro. I'm seeing some weird shit.
No, t technically, I technically I don't love throwing combos because if I if I did love throwing combos the, the way the game honors it, if I love throwing the throwing it the way the game honors it, then I would be winning. But clearly, I don't. So clearly, I don't throw combos the way the game honors it, so I can't win. So right now, I'm getting all of a sudden I'm getting the brakes beat off of me. I felt like I was fighting good the entire fight. And then it got to a point where I, I don't know. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. I don't get it. I don't, I don't know if my, like I seen my head was hurt, but I really don't know like what side was hurt more than the other side. Uh, his head looks like his head is fucking destroyed, but I really don't know. I don't fucking know. So yeah, I hurt his head more than he hurt mine. Uh, I think I did. Fuck, I don't know, bro. Yeah, it's a it's a head box, but the problem is you can't do you can't do same side damage. Like you can't continue. I can't continuously hook them in the head so technically even though i i land a high percentage right hook i'm not getting awarded the same amount of damage unless i go right hook left hook right hook left hook so it's weird the numbers are are very very misleading the damage is not is not what the numbers say they are so now the numbers are all really like mis misconstrued. Yo, Greg, let me fight you again, Greg. Or somebody. Nah, bro. Like, like what I'm seeing is if I throw a right hook, I'm going to get 100% damage. And then I throw another right hook. I'm not going to get a, I'm not going to get 100% 100%. I'm going to get 100% maybe 20%. In order for me to get 200% head damage, I have to go right hook, left hook. So I get 100% 100%. Even though both punches hit the head, because I double hooked on the same side, I got 120 damage, 120% because it was on the same side versus if I did 100, 100. So the numbers are really fucked up now. So now it's it's very misleading. It's very misleading on on uh what you're doing or what actually happened. Like you literally have to be watching the fight. You can't just go to the end of the the end of the fight and look at the card and be like, "Yeah, he threw 300 head punches." Well, 300 head punches on the same side is totally different than, you know, left right left right or even if you if you fought like I fought and I did, you know, right, right, left, right, right, left, you're systematically, your numbers are going to drop off because every other punch was on the same side. So if you want to be fully efficient, you got to right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. That's full efficiency. But even then, I think the game punishes you for for throwing um for for throwing a repetitious um cycle of punches and since it doesn't tell you since you can't see your um that's that's exactly what I was going to talk about blended right here is since there's no there's no more bars you can't really tell 
how much damage you're doing by going right left right left like is there a significant drop off do you need to punch in two other locations and then go back to your right the game doesn't really tell you so i'm not really sure how how many punches you need to alternate before you go back to your right to get a hundred percent right hand damage i don't really know I, i'm assuming I, i'm just guessing if i had to guess you probably have to throw two punches in a different location before you go back to your right I'm thinking you at least have to throw two. So if you throw a right, you need to throw, you know, a left jab, a right body, a, a left body, and then back to your right. That's a long ways in between rights. So you go right, right hook, left jab, right body, left body, or maybe you could do this. You could do this. Right hook, left jab, right body, right head because you did a, a a head jab and a body hook and then you could go back up to the top and get that and get that uh that daze you can you can jab you can daze with jab jab hook yeah up down up down i think I think that's what you have to do. I think it's I think that's the the big thing like if you go if you go left right on on the head, you have to go to the body to to reset the damage and then come back up to the head. So you got to go right hook, left jab, right body, right head. And that I think that would give you like a um a premium damage dis, uh disbursement because you didn't repeat anywhere right head left head body right head i think that would help you and if you so right head left head body right head left body you see what i'm saying right head i think that would give you a hundred percent um damage output I think there's a there's a crazy threshold. You can't go head 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 head. You're gonna need to go, you know, head head body head body head head body. You're gonna have to do that. You're gonna have to switch hands. You're gonna have to level change. You know what I'm saying? Head head body head body head body body head. right that's what i'm saying yeah you're not you're not getting premium damage output i guess nobody wants to fight so i'm just gonna back out of here because i'm trying to get as many fights in as i can if nobody wants to fight i'll just leave i think that that's the only way you get premium uh premium damage output so i'm gonna give that a try what you're what you're gonna see me go for is i'm gonna throw I'm gonna throw what I said. Right hook, right hook, left jab, right, right hook to the body, right hook to the head. So I'm gonna see if something like that um gives me like a crazy damage output, like back to where it, it should be. Yeah, that that's that's basically what I'm talking about, Blunted. Uh, the the punches that you cycle through, clearly there's there's some type of invulnerability with the punch cycle. If you're not cycling different punches, 
you're going to run into an invulnerable punch. You're going to run into an empty punch. Even though you hit, it's not going to do a fucking thing. And that's a problem. I've never been a fan of fighters walking through punches. But now since the game is trying to punish spam, you're going to see fighters walk through punches, which is fucking weird. Yeah, I don't really fuck with heavyweight a whole lot, so I mean, I guess that's cool. Oh, that was that was in the patch notes to time your punches. Was that like a big was that a big emphasis in the patch notes to time punches? I I barely like I skimmed over it. Like this is something that I thought was really weird right here. It says the curve has been reduced across overall stamina and stamina regener regeneration, which means fighters with higher rated stamina have a less steep advantage. The ultimate goal here is to make sure that we're seeing punch stats that are more in line with what you would see in a real fight. This is a step and we'll continue to iterate this area of balance as we follow your feedback. So I'm thinking what they're saying here is that even if you have a deep stamina pool, um, you won't just because you have a deep stamina pool means that you won't be able to throw a longer combination than any other fighter based off of your stamina pool. Just because your stamina pool is deep doesn't mean you get to throw 15 punches and the other guy can't. I think it means that everybody's going to be close to throwing 15 punches, no matter how deep your pool is yeah you can tire out but what it's saying is a hundred percent stamina on each fighter even though their stamina pool is deeper but if you're at a hundred percent you should be able to throw a 10 punch combo just the same as the other guy at a hundred percent if you beat his stamina pool up then he's gonna start losing punches but if it's full, you should be able to throw the same amount of punches. They say they say the traits the traits are more like they're supposed to be. Damn it lazy, you showed up fucking late, bro. If this guy gets kicked out, then I'll fight you. Yo, what's up, Terry? Alright, it fucked up. Somebody can fight me, but I'm not fighting fucking heavyweight. I'm fighting welterweight. If you wanna fight, fight welterweight. Finna put up the code. Finna put up the code. If you wanna fight, you fight in welterweight.
you better come on with it. Cause I ain't got, like I said, whoever gonna hop in, they gonna hop in. I ain't got all day. My wife's gonna be home, and then I'm gonna not be playing the game. All right, let's go. Yo, thank you for the follow. Uh, relax. Thanks you for thank you for the follow. Relax. Yo, let's go. Jab, ready up, bro. What? What? I don't know, bro. I don't know. <laughs> I am hands. <laughs> Lazy, wild as fuck. Boy said, I'm hands. I am the hands.
Yeah, man, I stay in the MBK Discord. MBK. All right, big dog. It depends on, I think there's another guy online, but you know, whoever is ready gets the fight. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of that lazy right now i ain't even fucking confident bro getting any frame drops nah i'm not getting frame drops bro my frames is good seen anything like your chat bro you constantly have people coming in to fight you <laughs> well my stream literally says fight me that's the name of my stream fight me but then again I think you have to uh This is, I'm not, this is, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to say, you know, you know, angles, you know, I love you, bro. You know, I love you, bro. I'm just going to put it to you like this. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm not trying to say nothing crazy. I'm not trying to say nothing out the way. As much as people don't like people want to, they want to yell out box and things like that. That nature about boxing styles, this, this, and that. People they want to see your fight style and they want to say yeah you know what i could out punch him that's what they wanted that's what they want to see they're like look he's going to give me an opportunity to win or lose and i got more power in my hands than he does that's what they want unfortunately you fight so good and that let me put it back into a positive light you fight so good I think a lot of people feel like they don't have a chance against you. No goose, I do not like it. Sure, Goose, you're going to give it to me anyways. That's pretty that's pretty much my my problem with it. The damage needs to be buffed. You walk through punches too much and I don't I don't like to see fighters walk through punches. It fucking it bothers me that there's such a thing as a as an empty punch. It bothers me that that you could punch somebody twice and the game will say, nah, that's spam, so it doesn't count. That's what bothers me. I 
Oh yeah, I, I'm always gonna bang, bro. Like, that's the way I like to fight. It's just now I gotta figure out, I gotta figure out how to bang a different way. And it's weird, I ain't gonna lie. It's weird. And right, right now, what they award, what I see with the award right now is lightning hands. You see a lot of, a lot of fighters have lightning hands. Lightning hands is is what is what's going to allow you to to bang in any fight. Lightning hands is what it is because lightning hands will allow you to go left, right, left, right really fast, and then you're going to be able to compile enough damage to get the rock. Um, that's what I see as a problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's confident. He's confident, man. So let him, let him keep his confidence. I just flat out don't like it. I don't like the patch. That's all there is to it for me. I just don't like it. I don't, I don't I don't like that the game allows you to walk through punches. That's what I don't like. The damage isn't high enough and it allows you to walk through punches. And that's a problem. So I'm sta I'm starting I'm starting to see something. I'm starting to see something. But the problem is the game still allows you to walk through punches. I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it. D don't think don't think Hook City went anywhere. Hook City's still here. Hook City's still here. But I see Don't think Hook City went anywhere. Like I see where where I can bring Hook City back. But I still feel like there's a problem that you could walk through punches and that shit ain't right. I don't care I don't care what you do. I don't care how you say it, how the developers want to say it or they don't want to say it or whatever. Like I understand that you, that they're trying to devalue spam. But you can't have guys out here walking through punches, bro. It just don't make sense. It just doesn't. It just don't make sense. Yeah, you won't be saying that. You won't be saying that in a little bit. Trust me. Watch, watch how my fight style is gonna 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 start working, and you're gonna be like, ah, it's the same old shit. Cause really, really, it is the same old shit. The problem is, is that they've added a lot of fake punches. They've added a lot of fake punches in the game. That's the problem. There's a lot of fake punches. Yeah, it it really is. It's going to be the same old shit. Because what I'm trying to tell you is there's there's a lot of empty punches in the game. That's what I'm seeing. Watch, it's going to be the same old shit. I can I can see it right now. I've literally just kind of peeped something in this fight. And you'll go you'll go right back to not playing the game even though you say it's perfect. You'll go right back to not playing it. Cause it's gonna be the same old shit.
It says, bro, I haven't played it yet. You haven't played it? How are you going to say the game is perfect if you haven't even played it? That's another thing I'm seeing. A lot, a lot of people are looking at the game and they're like, oh, yeah, it's great. It's great now. It's great now. I love the patch and they ain't even played it. How is that possible? All I can tell you is watch my fight style, and then you're going to be like, yeah, 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 I see what he's saying. I see what he's saying. Just watch how my fight style is changing, and you're going to be like, oh, yeah, yeah, Hook City's still here. Just watch. I tell you my problem, my problem has been trying to understand... I've been trying to understand the empty punches. That's my problem. There's there are now empty punches in the game. And when I when I say empty punches, empty punch is a spa, is the spam punch. So if I go right hook, right hook, the second hook is an empty punch. The first one 100%, the second one 20 or 0. So there's a lot of empty punches in the game. And I'm trying I was trying to figure out how to how to reset the punch. How to reset the um how to reset the 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 arm fatigue basically. It's not empty on the cards, but it's empty on the damage. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. They still score, you just ain't gonna knock nothing out. They definitely, all the punches score. Right, they want you to alternate hands. But really what they want you to do is they want you to, if you're paying attention to me, really what they want you to do is they want you to hit both, top and bottom. If you're really paying attention to me, they want you to hit top and bottom. Now, now I'm getting, now I'm getting into the realm to where I'm giving away the sauce again. Pay attention to my fight. Pay attention to my fight. What they really want you to do is go top to bottom. They don't want you to stay on the top. They don't want to stay. They don't want you to stay a sniper or a body hunter. They really want you to level change. No, it's never it's never going to be like they uh, all right. You know what? I'm I'm going to let you have it. I'm not I'm not going to argue that. I'm not going to argue it. I won't argue it. If that's if you if you say that's what it is, I'm just going to hold you to what you say it is. Bro, the empty punches. It's not just a one, two. What are you talking about, Jose? The pu that punch in different directions and it won't hit. I'm not following you, Jose. That I punch in different directions and it won't hit. I'm not understanding what you're writing. So hit detection. <clears throat> they they in the in the sense of what you're saying, yes, J Surge, they want you to box. But it's still a video game. 
So we're trying to figure out how to how to effectively win in a video game. That's what that's basically what I'm going about. They're, they've changed some things, and it and it abides by video game laws. You know what I'm saying? So like, in reality, if I hit you with two right punches, they're gonna hurt the same. But in the video game land, if I hit you with two right punches, there's gonna be some math, fake ass mathematical um situation that comes across as spam like in real life if i if i boom boom like there's no spam god gonna come down and say hey uh that don't that shit don't count so you have to fight in the turn within the laws of the game is what i'm talking about fight within the laws of the game Oh yeah, no, desync is still in the game, bro. There's still a ton of desync in the game, but I'm alluding to if you punch somebody consecutively, same side, the second punch is empty. It counts for nothing but a point. You're not going to get the rock. So, Jay Serge, if you're paying attention, if you're paying attention, you see my fight style. It hasn't actually changed a lot. I'm just now, I'm comprehending what the problem is. If you see that I just beat him right there, my fight style didn't change. I'm learning how to fight within the within the game rules, within the realm of what the game considers spam and I'm trying not to throw empty punches. The game is like deleting your punch. That's that's why I said like, yo, I don't like it because your eyes tell you I hit that guy. But the game says, no, 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 no damage. So, so that's what I've been adjusting to why I've been like, yo, I don't like this shit because I guess the problem that I have with it is why would they allow you to throw punches that don't count? Does that, that doesn't make any sense. Why would they allow you to spam, but punish you for the spam? Like if, if, if the punch is inoperable, if the punch doesn't work, why is it, why does it even exist? Why does it even, why does it even, like, if you press the button, why does the punch even come out? If it's, if it's an operable, like, you know what I'm saying? It's not an optimal punch. It's insane. So, now you have to learn optimal punches. That's what I'm getting at. You have to learn optimal punches and you have to learn why the punch is optimal. The punch is optimal because the game says left, right left right top left right bottom left right top is more optimal than right right left right right left right right left is not optimal that's weird it's weird because you can still throw it but it doesn't count Can I see the yes thank you So the one the one thing that you're the one thing that you're going to see is okay check this out. If you're if you're if you understand how to play the game, if you understand the rules, the the rules that they have now implemented in the game, a power fighter is going to be technically is going to be really really strong. And I'm I'm talking about this I'm talking about this on like on a Thank you. all right. Time a snack. No. Okay. Bye bye.
what I'm talking about on on a level of like a like they like everybody talks about like is there is there a curve is there a um is there like a big a big buffer in between like a beginner fighter and a high level fighter that's what everybody wants there wants there to be a big gap in between skill and you just started i can tell you right now um fighters that just started are going to be all speed fighters lightning hands is going to be it is is the cheese of the game right now lightning hands is the cheese if you want if you want to be able to knock somebody out pick fast fighters lightning hands you don't have to think all you got to do is go left right left right left right left right left right left right you don't have to think if you want to fight on a high skill level you pick a power fighter and you choose your shots the right way the power fighter is going to be the higher skilled fighter the cheese fighter is going to be the lightning hands fighter that you don't have to think at all. So what they've really introduced into the game is there's arm fatigue and now there's such a thing as damage fatigue. Spam fatigue, there's damage fatigue. That's what I'm going to call it. That's what I'm going to call it for now on. There's there's two things going on in the game. There's arm fatigue and there's damage fatigue. You have to understand to not keep hitting the same area that you need to move around in the body so that you don't accumulate damage fatigue you may think you're fighting you may think that you're fighting well and that you're um you're beating up your opponent but in actuality if you if you throw a lot of punches in the same area there's going to be damage fatigue that's what I'm gonna I'm gonna name it damage fatigue. Have you played it yet, Serge? Have you played the game yet?
Yeah, damage fatigue. That's what I'm gonna call it. Damage fatigue. If he, I mean, yeah, I find I find that that's crazy that you know that you would that you would even that somebody would even argue if they're if they haven't played it. Like, I find I find that's like not cool at all. Y'all guys is funny as hell. Yeah, why why I call it damage fatigue is because that's that's literally what it is. If you're telling me that I lose, so let let's 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 break it down. Let's break down what damage fatigue is. If you throw the same arm three times, your arm slows down. You have a speed, you have an arm fatigue, a speed fatigue. If you punch in the same area three times, the first punch does maximum damage. The last punch does like zero damage. Wouldn't that be called damage fatigue? I'm going to call it damage fatigue. So, and it feels like it, it works. If it, it feels as if, even if you punch, even if you're not throwing the same punch, if you're not throwing the same right hook, if you throw a right hook and then a right straight, it feels as if you still have damage fatigue. Yeah, damage reduction. So I'm going to call it damage fatigue. That's what I'm going to call it. <laughs> damage reduction, fatigue or whatever. I'm gonna call it fatigue. It's definitely um, a reduction, and it's not. It's not what you would think. It it is not. It's not work. I don't think it's working as intended. It's not what you would think that it would be. So have you been have you been watching my fight style change here angles? And if you've been watching, you could you could see that I've noticed something. You're gonna see more knockouts from me again because I'm catching on to I'm catching on to how to reset. I'm catching on how to, to how to reset the uh the punch counter. It's not, that's the thing, like, they, they want you to mix it up, but it's not really a mix-up. There's a, there's a clear reset. There's a clear reset to, to how to, that's why I call it damage fatigue. There's a, yeah, there's a clear way to reset the damage. Okay, J Surge. Now, if I said that shit to you, you you would not be cool about it. You would not. You would definitely not like that.
Yeah, I don't. I don't think this is a clear. Um, I don't think it's a clear like use your brain thing. It's more of a a fundamental game thing. I don't. I don't think it's that. Like, I don't think it's people are thinking or they're not thinking or anything like that. I think it's just fundamentally. Um, they've added, they've they've added damage reduction to the game. I like to call it damage fatigue. But it doesn't. You're still. You're still not. You still don't have to use your brain. Like I said, the clear. You're gonna be able to tell the fighters that um. You're gonna be able to tell the fighters that actually know how to play and the ones that don't know how to play. Lightning hands. Lightning hands is just that, bro. Lightning hands are. Uh, I can argue it's less thinking for me in this patch. Yeah, light lightning hands is is just that. Yeah, you don't you don't have to think a whole lot because there's so there's so many punches that are basically like um they're empty. There's so many empty punches. Yeah, you're not yeah, and somebody like angles, you're not gonna be able to combo angles ever. What you could do to angles though is you could use a power fighter and maybe just run around and and, and try to tag them one punch at a time. And you might be able to knock angles out with one punch at a time tags. Maybe. Maybe. But I think that that would be, that would be counterintuitive for the way, the way the angles fights. I, I think that he would just outpoint the fuck out of you. Like you would have no chance at beating angles up trying to knock him out that would be counterintuitive my style one my style one change i'll just score less knockdowns but it still is in the lines with real boxing uh That was very interesting right there. I threw a double hook and I got a counter on the on the second hook. But I most likely got the counter on the second hook because the first hook didn't connect. 
I missed on the first hook and got the counter on the second one. That was pretty interesting. As you can see, I'm winning the same way I used to win yesterday. It's just different. It's different. There's a there's a difference on the re, on the refresh. I still won. I still won throwing the hook yesterday, right? Everybody's watched BZ play hundreds and hundreds of hours. I still won with the hook yesterday. I'll win with the hook today. It's just different. It's, it's the same. I won with the hook yesterday. I won with the hook today. It's just a little different. It's really in... Very, very strange. It's different. But you can still win. You can still you can still win. It's just different. Different but the same at the at the same time. Like there's a lot of weird like I'm saying, like empty punches. It looks like these guys are just taking an absolute beating, but a lot of their punches are just fucking empty. So right there, I was able, I was able to get a double. I threw a double right hook, and I got a. <clears throat> I threw a double right hook, and I got a crushing blow on the second hook. I got a crushing blow. So.
Yeah, you definitely have to pick your shots because you can't. You have to pick your shots because you can't hit the same spot. That's pretty much the only reason why you, you, you know, like pick your shots. I mean, you'd be picking your shots if you're hitting the same spot. You're still picking, right? But you, you have to pick different shots. Is the body blocking different? No, the body blocking's the same. So, like I said, you see right there, I'm winning the same way I won yesterday. It's different though. You're gonna you're still seeing the same pretty much the same fight style, but there's a lot of empty punches. It's like it's like a mirage. So that's what you like where I where I was watching where I'm fighting earlier today, I'm like, yo, it doesn't make any sense. Like how people are how people are getting knocked down. I'm like, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. Cause some of the punches amount to nothing. Dad, this way. It's bedtime. Okay. And I think the game is going to become ultra defensive as well. Um, yeah, they they address like lead body uppercut or something like that. Like something's going to be different. But uh, that's not that's not in the game yet. They just talked about it. Yeah, yeah, game is so weird right now. So weird. Yeah, it says you have 100% health. Yeah, there's definitely something broken with that. I noticed that within the first the first hour of playing that yeah, it's broken. Like right there when I threw uh, earlier when I threw that that left check hook, like pre patch that probably would have been a knockout punch, but it's like it's like people have fucking armor on right now, bro. That's that's what it feels like. There's so many empty punches in the game. It feels like they have armor. That literally was the first like one of the first punches I landed, 
over the back of his head, and it should have KO'd him. But it didn't for whatever reasons. No, there was there was no need to mix anything up at that point. He's hurt enough where one punch can take him out. And I landed that one punch. But it didn't knock him out. So that's what I'm talking about. I'm at the point of the mix-up doesn't matter. All I need is one good flash counter. Should knock him out. And I hit him, but it didn't give me the knockout. So I thought that was very weird. It's like he has on fucking armor. Like one powerful punch right now should, I don't know how close he is to knocking me out, but I definitely know he's in the knockout range. He's in the knockout threshold. Wait, is that is that a thing? Is flat is flash days a thing? Uh because I'm I'm fighting doing my own thing. What do you mean? Why am I not on Discord? Fighters are now more likely to hit their opponents into days by mixing up their punches and landing both the same repeated. The chance of landing a flat this does not impact the chance of landing a flash days. Huh. Flash days, that's a thing. Okay. Well, that's what I was looking for. I was looking for a flash days right there. Based off of that check hook where his where his health is he's in flash days territory like there's no mix-up needed he's definitely in flash days territory Yeah, I've read that one quite a few times. Like right there, I caught him. I caught him clean on the side of the head. He should be flash dazed. So I'm not... That's something that's like weird. Right now, he's in, he's in flash dazed territory for real. And uh, I'm not getting the rock. Yeah, it probably has to be a crushing blow, uh, uh, a counter that's a crushing blow. That probably has to be it. You think you think it's random? It's like the flash KO is just random. when they throw combos but you're blocking them then throw a power counter so
Yeah, I I think I know what you like. Like I hit people with uppercuts. That's not. It doesn't like actually. It's not a flash KO. It just puts you in the daze. But I never thought to call that a flash daze. That's like a flash daze is basically like a critical counter, a critical counter that puts you into a daze. That isn't. I don't know if you, I don't think that I would call that a flash daze. But I guess it is what it is. And I've pretty much never seen a flash daze on a hook. I've seen flash dazes on like a, a upper a chin uppercut. Um or a right straight, a back stepping straight. Anybody trying to fight? Put the code in right now for anybody that's trying to fight. I might only have one more fight in me, and then I have to get off of here, I think. Like one more fight before my wife gets home. But I guess at this point they've they've completely removed spam, right? So since spam is completely removed, nobody can claim that they got spammed to death at this point because there's basically just empty punches. You know what I think what I would call spam nowadays, I would call spam a lightning hands fighter. A fighter that just goes fucking left, right, 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 left, right. That's what I would call a spammer on this patch. Somebody that just left, right, left, right. That's what they look like. Left, right, 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 left, right. That's the new spammer. The ultra le level changing left writer. And believe me, you're gonna see it. You're gonna see it. You're gonna see people that you go. You're gonna go into these rank matches, and you're gonna see people using Amir Khan. With the lightning hands, and he's gonna come in that baby. Boom, 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 boom. He's gonna look goofy as fuck, and he's gonna knock you out every fucking time. Says maybe light punches mixed with the with the strong punch hook or something. Next one, a couple body shots. <laughs> I mean that's that's basically it, man. Like just it's that's what I call um, there's there's damage fatigue. Basically, not only do you have arm fatigue, like don't swing your right arm three times. It doesn't matter if you punch the head or the body. Don't swing the the right arm three times to the head or the, like you don't arm fatigue. Don't swing the right arm three times. Don't go head body head body head body with the right arm because you're gonna get slow. The same thought process is don't go right side of the head, right straight, right uppercut. 
you're not I don't think you're gonna you're not gonna get awarded very well if you focus all on the right side of the head you're you're gonna you're gonna get damage fatigue if you go right hook right overhand right straight right uppercut all that shit is not good it's not good So we got, we definitely got somebody that made a new account. You think it's good? What does that mean? When I say not good, I mean not effective. Not effective to go right hook, right uppercut, right straight. I don't think that that is an effective combo because it's all on the right side. Same side damage, damage fatigue. Yeah, that too. You definitely want that. That's kind of always been a thing. You want your you want your stamina bar full when you throw. That's why uh, the game is definitely definitely awarding power punchers, but it's also awarding um lightning lightning hand spammers. So did you see that mix up that I did right there? Did you see that combo I did right there? That was that was mixing it up. That was resetting the um the damage oh, what do I call it? So check this out. Check this out. I think I got a pretty good handle on it. Check this out. Watch me rock them again. You see me rock them again? There's clearly a damage reset. You have to understand how to reset. Um, there's a there's a what did I call it? I called it the uh, the damage uh. <laughs> what was the goofy word that I was using that Surge didn't like? What's the goofy word that I was using? Damage fatigue. Yeah, that's it. There's clearly a damage fatigue, and there's a way to reset it. You just see me do it. I wouldn't technically call that a combo. I use the parameters of the game to reset my damage. I wouldn't call that a combo. I'm going to do it again. He's hurt pretty bad. Watch this.
You see that right there? You see that right there? I wouldn't call that a combo. That's just me personally. I wouldn't call that a combo. Was I on his ass? Was I on his head? Yeah, I was on his head. But I wouldn't call that comboing. I would call that resetting a damage fatigue. I was I w <laughs> sure you could you could say that um you could I think and there's always this literature between a, a game game combo and IRL like there's all like we're boxing in a game and people say, talk about IRL and then they talk about game like in a game, a combination is like boom, 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 like a whole bunch of shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like a fast combo, like a, a chaining of of a, a fast. Combo. You don't have to chain your punches. You don't have to chain them. You could right hook, wait two seconds. Left hook, wait two seconds. Uppercut wait two seconds right hook wait two seconds that's not a combo in in game language that's not a combo in in irl that might be a combo So I'll do it again. I, I see I, I see what's going on now. It took me a minute for my brain to process this empty punch mechanic, this damage fatigue mechanic. It took me, I literally played for nine hours this morning and I was like, yo, this is some bullshit. It took me a minute to figure it out. But watch, you're going to see me get more knockouts now because I'm, I'm, comprehending what's going on <laughs> it's it's always going to be hook city i told y'all that a minute ago it's always going to be hook city you could think that it ain't going to be hook city you lied to yourself you lied to yourself if you think it ain't going to be hook city You lied to yourself if you think it ain't gonna be Hook City. You fucking lied to yourself if you think it ain't gonna be Hook City. You fucking... You fucking lied to yourself if you think it ain't gonna be Hook City. <laughs> yeah, they they always think it's a joke till they get smoked. It's like, oh yeah, yeah, I'm 
it's always you watching what's going on from the outside looking in. You're always watching. You're like, ah, oh, yeah, I can handle that. I can handle that. Till you get in the ring and you get smoked. Till it's coming at you full speed. Then it's like, oh, nah, oh, nah, oh, nah. It's always Hook City, baby. Look at them now. Look at them now. It's always Hook City. Dude, hurt already, bro. Watch how I do them. Look at that. Look at that. Hurt. He hurt like a motherfucker. Watch how I do him. He hurt real bad. Watch how I do him. Yeah, you can get next next fight. If I have a next fight, you can get it. I can see it now. I can see it now, bro. I can see it now. I can see I can see what the problem is. I can de I can definitely see the problems now. Like it's still it's still a whole bunch of you know empty punches. Like there like I see I still see punches that are that are not as critical as you would think that they are. But I mean this is what people want. This is what everybody say they want. They say they want it like this. This is how they got it.
That's a bad habit. I got to break that double hook. That's a bad habit. It's not that it's not that it's really hurting me that much. It's that it takes away from my stand pool for me to be able to do something else. Fuck no, bro. You know how long that hook would take to come out? Like, look at that. It takes too long to throw it. That shit, I'll, I'll almost never land that motherfucker if I throw a power, a power hook. It takes too long. He's hurt right now. He's turtled up because he's hurt. That's something you got to watch because technically you can turtle up real good. You could turtle up real good in this because of damage fatigue. You could actually turtle up real well. There's definitely there's definitely something that you have to do to mix there's a if you keep punching through his block eventually he'll damage up. <laughs> yeah. Come on, bro. You you know I stay in a lab. You know I stay in a lab. All I did was voice my opinion. I said I don't like it. That doesn't mean that I can't that I can't adjust. I just said that I don't like it. I can adjust. I can make adjustments. It's a video game. I just don't like it. That's all. Like everybody was telling me they hated the last patch. They hated the hooks being buffed. They hated it. And I had to listen to it for like two months. Two months of people saying they hated the hook buff. And then on the first day I say I hate the patch. People are like, BZ, stop crying. Stop crying. It's more like real boxing. It's more like real boxing. It's a simulator. Stop crying. But I heard him cry for two months. I got you, Godspeed. I heard I, I not only did I hear him cry for two months, I heard him I heard him take off their boxing gloves. They took them off and they hung them up on the wall. They wasn't even they wasn't even streaming. That's how bad they cried. They was defeated, bro. They was defeated. That's how bad they cried. Straight up defeated. They didn't even. They didn't even have a voice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Them, them guys. Not only did they struggle for two months, they just quit, bro. They just straight up quit. I didn't quit. I said I didn't like it. I was I was mad about it. I said I didn't like it. I went to sleep. I took a nap. I woke up knocking motherfuckers out. There's a code, bro. I, I see what you have to do to get it done. <laughs> Good morning, Brins. I see what you have to do to get it done. I still don't like it. I don't like it, bro. I think it I think it's I don't know, man. I, I think it's uh I think it's I think it's some bullshit. Yeah, I, I could see that. I think they need to up the damage just a little bit. They need to up the damage just a little bit. I understand what's going on in the fight. I don't like it, but I I'm starting to understand what's going on.
<laughs> yeah. Yeah, basically if this if this doesn't work, they're fucked, bro. If if this situation if people don't like how the game is right now, like me, I don't like it, but I'm just one person. If the majority of the community comes out and says they don't like this shit within a week or two, they're in trouble. They, they are absolutely in trouble if the majority of the community comes out and says, hey, I know you made this change for us, but we don't like what we got. Bro, they are fucked. They are in dead. They, they are in the they are dead in the water. Fucked. Yeah, it, it, ha it has to be enjoyable. There's no going back. Like where it's at right now, there's no going back. You can't go back to same side damage after switching. To the, You can't like... What I'm asking for, you're not going to get. I'm not going to... What I'm asking for, I'm not going to get it. I think they need to buff the damage a little bit more. And they need to allow some of the same side same side damage a little bit more. But I think what I'm asking for, I'm not going to get. I think it's not going to happen. Go ahead, ready up, Sergio. Godspeed, ready up. I think what I'm asking for won't happen. Won't happen at all. So I just have to deal with it the way the way the game is. The way it is is what I got to deal with. Like y'all, but y'all have been watching me. This is a matchup that I don't like. Like I fucking hate, I hate Sergio. This is a matchup that I don't like. Talk about, talk about like being in a shitty situation. Sergio's got a bad hitbox, and you're supposed to mix up your punches with a bad hitbox versus a southpaw. Oh, this is a bad situation. But I'm gonna fight it. I'm gonna fight it anyways. We'll see what happens. This is tough. This is tough. You know what's weird? You know what's weird? It's like you have an automatic defense. That's what's weird about it. Like, if you pay attention to a fighter and you see them same, same, same side spam, you don't have to acknowledge that they're hitting you. You could just be like, whatever, and walk through it. You got automated defense. That's what's weird. If you see somebody do some shit that you know doesn't work, you don't have to honor it. That's why I say it's weird. That's some weird shit. You you don't have to you don't have to honor keep your lead foot inside of his. Yeah, that's the problem with Southpaw. If you keep when you if you this guy right here, he's on the visitor side. If you walk down the mat on a southpaw and he throws a left hook, he will knock you the fuck out.
<laughs> oh man. I don't even know what to think about that. Left, right, left, right, body, body uppercuts. I don't even know what to think. Am I protected from that? Am I protected or am I gonna get rocked? I, I don't even know what that is. Am I, am I protected from left, right, left, right, body spam? See what I'm talking about? Like you, you have like a, a auto immune system for defense. If somebody is doing something, if somebody's doing something that doesn't work, you do not have to honor it. So if I know for a fact that left, right, left, right body spam doesn't work, I could just stand there. And let and just let them do it. Just let them do whatever, because I know that it doesn't fucking work. I don't have to honor it. Man, I hate it because it because I would love to see this game succeed. Imagine different skins and gloves, maybe even depending on your rank. Golden gloves, new boxers, no market for it. It's all about big money, like films and shit nowadays. No CGI scripts, just boxing. It's not something. The mass love to play. They would rather play Fortnite. Or... Yeah, absolutely. That's that's what I'm talking about. Empty punches. Like I think this guy's throwing a lot of empty punches, and I don't have I don't have to honor him going left, right, left, right to the body. I think I think I'm protected from that. And see, isn't that weird? Like if I say that I'm protected from a certain amount, a certain type of spam, I don't have to honor it. I can just walk through it. Is that, is that simish? Is that even simish thinking? To me, that doesn't, that doesn't, that doesn't say sim. Like it. So there so see it's still in the game. It's still in the game. This guy just literally just did it. So instead of going from the lead body uppercut, now you just go left right left right left right like I told you what was going to happen. I told you exactly what's going to happen. People are going to be doing this. Left right left right to the body to the head. Left right left right left right right left right. They're going to be doing this. This is going to this is the new meta. This is the new meta for no skill. That's it. You heard it here first. Left, right, head, left, right, body. Left, right, head, left, right, body. Left, right, head, left, right, body. That's the new meta. Look, let me show you what it's going to look like. I'm going to show y'all. It's going to look like this. It's going to look like that. It's going to look like that. Just a whole bunch of left, right, left, right. And then somebody's going to throw a lucky uppercut.
P.O.P. I knocked him out by fifth round. Yeah, that's that's wild, bro. It's it's wild that it's wild that you know it's still the same, bro. It's more of the same. absolutely wild so i'm getting i'm getting a i'm getting a lesson here on <laughs> i'm getting a spam lesson for sure i'm getting a spam lesson a new spam lesson getting a whole new spam lesson. So you're you're not like I don't think you're you're not like likely to get knocked out by the left right left right body, but it can still be effective as you see he's, he's ate up all my stamina in the fifth round he's ate up my entire body stamina by by doing that um so you could just obviously you could just get out the way if somebody's doing left right left right you could just you could just move, I suppose, right? You could just get out the way. Kind of hard to to deal with Sergio that way, southpaw and everything, but you you could. Like I said, the new meta is going to be lightning hands, left, right, left, right, left, right. No combo, that's not a combo, that's just left, right, left, right, left, right, lightning hands. <laughs> yeah, you could you could try that. You would definitely have to um like if you see somebody doing that you know what i'm saying probably loose foot them loose foot them you know what i'm saying to to be able to make them miss a whole lot so this game this basically this game's got like an auto auto defense in it you know what i'm saying like it's protecting you from yourself or from the new meta is stigma he's op <laughs> you stigma I don't think I can select Sigma.
Yeah. I'm done. I'm toast, bro. Yeah, he he burned me up with the with the left right left right bodies. Um it, it didn't see like it won't get you rocked, it won't knock you out, but it will burn up your stamina. So I don't know, bro. It's like this is crazy ass invulnerability system that's in the game. It's a weird invulnerability system that's in the game now. Damage fatigue is real. I have no idea what y'all guys are talking about. Now, let me try to get one more fight in here. Let me get one more fight in here. Yes, sir. Good fight, Godspeed. Good fight. Yeah, there's a... You do have to... You do have to protect your body. You have to... I don't think... You don't have to protect your body for fear of getting rocked. You have to protect your body for for fear of getting your stamina like fucking shredded what? you're not you're not going to see 1k viewers until the game is fully released until they finish the game when they finish the game you'll see 1k viewers But I can tell you right now, you're not you're not gonna see 1K viewers with the unfinished game. With the with the way the game is set up right now, you're not gonna see 1K viewers. <laughs> I was here first. Yeah, I I, I was here very early in the game. I was here very early. I wouldn't say I was first. I was like two or three days. Two or three days into the release. Um, damn, I guess nobody's going to come in here. You need the game on the new console to make the game popular. Like, Nah, I mean, if when they release the game on console, they, they won't need me to make the game popular. It's going to be popular no matter what. I'll keep doing what I'm doing on... Uh, right here on on twitch on stream bro i i can do right what i'm doing right here is going to be the same thing on console as it is on pc hello what's back, up back from that rte uh-huh and my head feels like somebody bashed in my head somebody bashed in your head that's what yeah. it feels like that's how my head feels they updated this game and i don't like the update it feels like somebody bashed in my head do you got any benadryl oh yeah there should be some in the bathroom in there Is, you came home by yourself or mom's still working or what's up? No, mom probably went because she, she had her friend in the car with her, so I don't know if she's going to Oh, okay. Her yeah, she went to drop her off. What? So, yeah, that's fucking wild. It's definitely wild. You can't, like,. There's weird there's weird things. Okay, so there's damage fatigue. So if you're trying to knock somebody out, you have to do it the right way. Then there's you can spam the body to burn stamina. That's a strategy. You can go for the knockout if you do it the right way. You can spam the body to burn stamina and you can point somebody even if you point them with same side damage you can point them to death so there's three weird ways to win that you that you can do i think they're weird because it just it don't feel right
What are you talking about? Is that a person? New new saw? Is that a is that a streamer? He's got. All right. Let you. He's streaming right now with four thousand viewers. Oh wow. combo system is fucking weird bro i understand how to use it now i understand how to work it but it's fucking weird the combo system is fucking weird i'm gonna tell you straight up bro it's it's fucking weird as shit Yeah, it's, it's definitely good for the game. Anybody that can bring in 5K viewers, I mean, hey, good good for them. If they can bring in 5K viewers, good for them and good for the game. I'm not that popular on Twitch to bring in 5K viewers, but if I was, I would. <laughs> I don't think he'll fight me. I'll just be one of the 5,001 people that's talking that he's not listening to. I mean, if he's anything like me at this point in time, if, if I were a 5K... If I had 5,000 people and I got on this game today and started playing it, that would come out of my mouth. I would say don't buy this game. That, that's what would come out of my mouth. If I brought 5K people to the game today and played it, that shit would come out of my mouth. So I wouldn't say that it's his fault. Definitely not his fault if he does say that, you know, like it is what it is. So that, that fight didn't even count, man. I wanted to do one more fight, but that shit definitely did not count. So I'll do another one. I'm level 42, so I got some new player cards. The Titan. I'm the Titan now, baby. And I got the Midnight Sunset.
You know what's funny? Like, check this out. Since I understand how to knock somebody out now, let me see if I can get lucky and somebody will, will come in the uh somebody will come in the phone booth with me as Canelo. Let's just see how easy it'll be as Canelo if they get in the phone booth with me. I kind of got it figured out. Watch, watch this, watch this Nello in the phone booth. All right, Nello in the phone booth is gonna be absolutely brutal. This dude is gonna be brutal. You think the last fight ended fast? Canelo's gonna end some fights really fast if you don't. If the other fighter doesn't understand how to how to not get knocked the fuck out. <laughs> if that makes any sense if you don't understand how to not how to not not get knocked the fuck out do who a tutorial watch this shit right here watch this shit right here so i've been doing it i've been doing it with with Sugar Ray Leonard i'm going to do it with Canelo now and we're we're going to see if this shit's like stupid now he's not gonna listen to me. He's got five thousand people in there. Why would he? Why would he listen to me? You busy? Where you been, homie? Watch this shit right here. Let me see how fast I can pack them up. Let me see how fast I can pack them up. He's hurt bad. Oh, I thought I had him right there. Oh yeah, I told you, bro. I told you. Canelo's gonna be stupid. Canelo's stupid in the pocket, bro. Stupid in the pocket. I told you right there. Like once you once you learn how to hit the reset button, get the fuck out of here. Stupid. There's one there's one little secret. There's one little secret to the to this knockout game. One little secret. <laughs> it's not even really a secret. But yeah, Canelo's dumb, bro. Canelo's hella dumb. There's there's one thing, there's one thing that you need to do to get a knockout. There's one particular thing that you need to do. stamina
<laughs> what was that? There's <laughs> these knockouts are like it's silly, bro. I'm telling you, it's silly. The way they got it set up now, it's hella silly. I ain't gonna lie, it's hella silly, bro. Oh, that's my wife going. Oh shit. Say what? What's up, uh, Savage Boxing? Can't hear BZR because he's talking to. <laughs> nah, nah, it's talking to my wife, man. It's talking to my wife. Um, this is gonna be this is gonna be my last fight, actually. So, um, I'll have to. Uh, is there anybody that you want me to raid in particular? You just gave me the raid, and I could just uh, give it to somebody else. So, all right uh how do you like it so far uh job how do you how do you like it man i do not like it i absolutely hate it I understand. I'm starting to understand how to fight with it, but I absolute I absolutely hate it, bro. I absolutely hate it. Well, I I think the the reasoning why I why I don't like it is because yeah, I don't I don't feel that way. I don't feel that way about the new damage system. Because the, the problem I see with it is, like, visually, you're looking at the fighter throw different punches. Visually, you can visually spam, but it's ineffective. So, there's a, there's a certain technique to fight inside of, of, a, of the game inside of the gaming parameters there's a there's a, a technical way to fight that they want you to use but visually you can throw a punch and land it the punch will count the punch will count for a scorecard count 
and if you're throwing body punches the punch will count as far as burning your stamina but it won't count as far as rocking your opponent um so visually there's a lot of empty punches in the game so you throw the punch you hit the opponent it should rock them but because the game accounts for body spam there's like a there's an automatic defensive mechanism built in the game now it's like you don't have to honor certain punches the only thing that you have to honor is the points if they hit you with the punch if they hit you with spam you have to honor the point and if they body spam you you have to realize that you're gonna you're gonna lose stamina you will have permanent stamina drain so if they're body spamming you they're gonna get you with the points and they're gonna get you with permanent stamina drain but you won't get rocked so it's a little bit weird so I, yeah I, I don't like it for that reason now obviously if you mix up your punches or whatever you can get a knockout you saw me get a knockout I, un I understand how to I call it I call it damage fatigue damage reduction there is a, a damage fatigue in the game damage reduction um, you can uh, reset the damage reduction but uh, yeah I, I don't like it I think that it's um, I think it's just strange you see you see people walking through punches and that's the part that I don't like to me it doesn't it doesn't register in my mind that like I understand that why I'm able to walk through these punches but it's like an automatic defense what kicks in the damage reduction so what kicks in the damage reduction is if you hit the opponent in the same spot twice that's damn there's going to be damage reduction so think of it like this The game is punishing you to stop spamming and actually box. So yeah, that's that's the um, what you just said right there. That is what that's the feedback that I get from everybody. Everybody says the game is trying to force you to actually box, but the reality is is if you get hit by same side spam, you st you're still gonna get pointed, and you're still gonna lose stamina if they're spamming the body you're gonna lose spam you're gonna lose stamina if they're spamming the body and you're still gonna get pointed the only thing that it changes is the day's state putting somebody in the zone so the damage reduction really comes in when you're trying to daze somebody so say you're throwing a combination say you go right hook right hook yesterday before the patch right hook right hook would result in say 100% damage and then you get compound damage because you hit them in the same spot. So say 100% 150 Okay, so you did 250% damage Today when you throw right hook right hook you'll get a hundred percent and then maybe your next punch will be 20% so you're gonna get 120 today where yesterday you might have gotten 250 okay I understand what you're saying that's a W so follow me follow me here so now what you're trying to do because this is still a video game it's a boxing simulator but it's still a video game so inside of the video game guidelines what you're trying to do now is you're trying to do this you're trying to go right hook 100% damage left hook 100% damage body punch 100% damage back up to the head right or left let's so say you, so you're on the on the right you go back up to the head left hook 100% damage that's what you're trying to do now you're trying to always get pure damage right hook 100 left hook 100 right body 100 left hook 100 again so you're trying to reset the damage now you know me I'm famous 
for not spilling the sauce. That's some of the sauce, but I left out one key ingredient. I'm not going to tell because I like knocking motherfuckers out and I don't want, I don't want nobody using my sauce against me. So I left out a key ingredient of the sauce. But if you watch me fight, you're going to see me use the sauce. All I can tell you to do is pay close, close attention, close attention. Yeah, but see the the problem that I have with it, I understand same same side spam, but the problem I have with it is that now that they've they've introduced this um this reward for not doing same side spam, you have an empty punch. So now when you right hook right hook, you get a 100% and basically the next hook is zero. It's it's a it's a big goose egg. So you're getting nothing out of that second hook to the same spot, which I feel is it's somehow inappropriate. Somehow they gotta they gotta they gotta fix the problem is is that they allow you to do it and they punish you for doing so. So I, I figure like I don't know, it's weird. In the game, you can throw three right hooks. You could throw you could throw with your hand, you're with your right hand three times. So you could go right hook to the head, right hook to the body, and then right straight. So if you yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. So if you did a three piece with the same hand in the same spot, yeah, 100, 125, 150, a total of 150, not a total of 375, not 375, but a total of 150 is what you would get out of like same, same, same. So now what they want you to do is they want you to reset the um they want you to reset the uh the damage i call it damage fatigue because it sounds proper in my head even though it sounds a little bit weird but like basically if you throw the right hand three times your right hand slows down that's fatigue if you hit somebody in the same spot three times you're gonna get a damage fatigue a damage reduction so what they want you to do how do you reset how do you reset arm fatigue? You reset arm fatigue by throwing the opposite arm. So if you go right, 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 and then you throw left, your right arm is now reset. So you use the same, the same process. You go right hand 100%, left hand 100%, right body 100%, and then you go back up to the head 100%. So from a low skill player, from so what so what did low skill players do yesterday low skill players yesterday would just throw the same thing over and over they would just lead body lead body lead body right hook right hook right hook that would get you a win what will get you a win now is if you left right left right so what you're going to see people do is is left head right head left body right body left head right head left body right body that's going to be the new low skill player somebody that's going to go left head right head left body they're just going to do this bang 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 because they're trying to reset the uh they're trying to reset the damage while still being effective that's like the easiest effective way to fight like with without thinking about it left right left right left right left right just like this they're just gonna do this. A high skill player is gonna figure out how to reset the damage. Right, 
Right. Right. So now what you're going to see is high skill players. What I think you'll see out of high skill players is somebody that's um, probably. I tell you, Lightning Hands is OP right now. Lightning Hands is hella OP. So which uh, you're going to see a lot of players using fighters with Lightning Hands, and you're going to see them level changing a lot. You're going to see right hook, left hook. You're going to see the lead body, right hook, lead body, left hook. You're going to see that a lot because they're resetting the damage multiplier. And Roboxing, you're putting more bodily rotation to those hooks because you're hooking off each hook. So yeah, you're gonna you're gonna start to see you're gonna see more you're gonna see like the game used to be just mindless right, 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 lead body, lead body, lead body. You're gonna see more mindless left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, just mindlessly left, right, left, right. You're gonna see a lot of that. Um and it's gonna be effective. It will be very effective. Um, a high skill fighter is going to have to. Yeah, it's not. It's not gonna. It's not gonna work versus a a high skill player, a good player. But it's gonna be very effective for new players, especially if they got lightning hands. It's gonna be very effective. So, but left, left, left will be at a high level player because of how you can dish it out. Well, absolutely, absolutely. But you're going to be able to, you're pretty much going to be able to still dish out a left, right, left, right. Um, due to, especially if you're a lightning hands fighter with somebody, if you're fighting somebody that's not lightning hands. So you're going to see a whole lot of left, right, left, right. And uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're not going to 4X lead body upper and you're not going to 4X right hook. But you're going to see more of, you're going to see more of the same, but you're going to see it, it's going to be, it's going to translate differently. You're going to see it come out differently, but you're going to see more of the same um that's all that's all i can say is you're going to see high level players <clears throat> you're going to see high level players that are going to figure out how to how to dump the uh the damage fatigue that's what you're going to see out of high level players they're going to figure out how to dump the damage fatigue and land critical hits and uh it's it, it, there is a method to it. It does work. Um, it is what it is. That's what you're gonna see. Uh, you're gonna see people dump dumping the damage fatigue, and and you're gonna you're gonna see rocks. I don't know if inside inside boxing will be that valuable. I think it's gonna be more point boxing is back foot point boxing is going to be the most valuable thing if somebody's foolish enough to get in the phone booth with you then you know that's their business if somebody's foolish enough to get in the phone booth and you know how to rock somebody they will lose outside of that i think back foot point point boxing will be the meta will absolutely be meta um, if you if you get in the phone booth with somebody that knows how to combo KO you, then you're you're just at fault. You're just negligent to understanding how the combo works. You're ne you're negligent. Uh, I understand how it works now. Finally, it took me like ten hours, ten plus hours of boxing to figure it out. So if you get in the phone booth and you get knocked out, it's because you. Uh, you're you you're not you're not taking the time to understand
Um, but with that being said, I'm gonna pass the rate off. That's uh, that was my opinion. It's not facts. That's just BZR saying his opinion of what you're gonna see. And I hope all you fight fans have a great night. And I am going to find you. I'm gonna find somebody to raid. Let me see. Let me see who's in who's in my bag of raids. Let's see who's in my bag of raids. But hey, y'all, come back and watch me. Come back and watch me fight tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. I'll uh, I'll show you some mix-ups. I'll show you how to get the rock. And if you want to see somebody point you to death. I advise you to watch Angel, Angel. I advise you to watch Angles, Angles TV. If you want to see somebody point you to death, watch Angles TV. If you want to see some nasty rocks, come here and watch Hook City. Still in full effect, baby. Still in full effect. Um, <laughs> I like this guy. All gas, no brakes. I like that. Oh, you. Hey, here's this guy right here, yo. My dude, lazy. He's he's a great. He's a a great entertainer. Watch lazy. He might figure this thing out. I don't know if he's gonna figure it out or not, but he might. So watch my watch my dude, lazy, right here. We're gonna give them the raid. This should be fun. He likes to box with his shirt off. <laughs> That's lazy. You can see a lot of bombs. <laughs> He's a gay stream. Oh my goodness. <laughs>